What do you guys think? Good thumbnail? We are back in action with some more gaming computer... What should we even call these? Dell Optiplex Converted Gaming PCs. That seems like too much. So over here, we like to take old Dells, get them at a reasonable price, and then we like to flip them and turn a profit. Optiplex 3020 sporting an i5 GT740, a couple of custom blue LED fans with adapters so you don't get any fan errors on startup, 8 gigs of RAM, and a 1 terabyte SSD. Over here, we got a Optiplex 9090. Okay, let me rewind a little bit. This is the Optiplex 3020 SFF, small form factor. This is the Optiplex 9090 MT, mini tower. Um, we got the custom cutout side windows. We have a couple of blue LED fans in here. Guys, I don't wanna go too crazy with the LEDs. We like to keep it tasteful. We have a 1660 Ti in here, which is gonna do most games at a uh, high settings at 1080p <clears throat> 4k and you might be able to get by with some 4k gaming wouldn't recommend it but this guy has a brand new uh 450 evga power supply to support that hefty 60 1660 ti there's your 1660 ti with a brand new um cooler master i71c cpu cooler in there couple of custom LED fans with adapters so you don't get fan errors. Uh, we slapped two terabyte SSD in this guy. Here's the wireless adapter we're throwing in. It's actually not bad. This wireless 11AC USB adapter. A wireless Wi-Fi adapter so you can get right online if you have no hard line running to your desk. Now, if you or anybody you know needs a gaming PC, you want something affordable, we're, we're letting this guy go for 280 on our store. We're letting this guy go for 600 We did the front grills black. Um, the cases are in great condition, very light scratches, but overall solid build, no major dents. Everything's running good if you're interested in these PCs. See our store, which is, what is our store? We call it goodies and tech because we also sell other stuff on the store besides tech. Right now, the store is growing, so I think we have a couple of mechanical keyboards on there. Everything is in great, good condition, works well, tested. Um, just keep an eye on it, really good deals on there. Briefly, just wanted to touch on how we apply our tender love and care to these PCs, how we build them, and a little bit about our process. So the first thing we do with these builds is we replace the CMOS battery because you don't know how long that thing's been in there for. It could be dead. Then you're going to be dealing with your clock is resetting or your BIOS settings aren't being saved, so on and so forth. I think the, the average lifespan of a CMOS battery is what, two to five years, two to three years, somewhere around that range. So spend a few bucks, get a new uh, CMOS battery in these guys. Next up, take off that uh, CPU cooler heat sink, scrape off that old thermal paste and apply new thermal paste to these guys. What kind of grasshoppers are? I've never seen them like that. You? Uh, what do you guys think? You wanna see the grasshopper? He literally looks like one of the leaves. It's like a leaf with eyeballs. Then we give it a really good bath. We scrub it. We use a little bit of isopropyl rubbing alcohol. But yeah, just a really good cleaning of all the components, including the board. And yeah, I think that's pretty much it for now. I'll see you in the next video.